Dr. Alhaji Baumia, our vice president. The Lord brought him to me. It was very important. And when he came, he came with Alan Chematen. And he came with Honorable Kennedy, a compro in Japan. The three of them came. Alan Kodutra Martin kneeling down in time of the prayer. And I saw Alaji Maud Baumia sitting in a chair in time of prayer. I will see a form of church will be the other. Your friend, a mala maqualana me. Luna made a pang soda spiritual and herbal center. Your real beer, a walk, 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 Ebi ana wa spiritual marriage. Wu hao no eye hu hu asem. Wu ne sika engineer. Wu ko bridge. Wu bubo wu bubo mpaya enye ye. Wu de bra pang soba spiritual and herbal center. Me pese eko wa sumi se. Ye ye juma ye jiska. Wu no ma tuto ye ana wu de asida di ayede. Ebi abreye. Me biti se krata se me juma se. O hao unquadana. Wu de bra pang soba spiritual and herbal center. Ye beso ano. Me de ubi biara asi. You can't and come, sir, and then and come, sir. A DNT and also and come, sir, is he and as and come, sir, ever. If I saw a banner or and come, sir, so and come, sir, a day and a coupon, a dan, baby, a day, a return, a D for the ABC China and answer the ABC away in him and no another coupon, a dan, who a day, a return, a D for now, me, Prophet John Lord, a dear, Monitia, some machine combi, baby. Yanko pa den dan yama bi 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 edi edi achere me a me ka ebe mu me shen swa ijina enu nti e ye 2024 general election abato e kwa kutu yi ye ni mse dodo na a kwa kutu jina e ye Dr. Mahamad Baumia ene former president John Dramani Mahamasu u kosro na uba fom ki ane ke e yo mumi yonu ba ku eni bedi mkwe ni mu Na nyanku pwa dan bibi edi, bibi bibi edi afa, abatu yon edi achreme. Aha, ayo obi enfo radio. Mwumi yonko, nyanku ti Prophet John Lord. Nkwem sha, nyanku pwa nam naso, edi, eh, dom gana. Eni di obedi, nkwem nim, ewa 2024, abat etu yimu. Mwumi yonku ti Prophet John Lord. By the grace and the mercies of God, we thank God for life. You know, concerning prophecies God has been giving us a lot why is it so important for us to know what is ahead of us for us to know what our God is telling humanity and you know over the years we have been dealing with a lot of prophecies home and abroad and once again we need to talk to the people concerning the mind of God and what the Lord is saying I know maybe you know me maybe you don't know me that is not what we are discussing today I prefer to be known by God and unknown by the people We have been dealing with a lot of prophecies concerning the death of Professor Miss, the death of Jelly Rawlings, 2016 MPP general election, NDC general, uh, 2016 Ghana's general elections. So many prophecies. But I have to let all of you to understand that December 7 is just around the corner. 
people who want to know is the Lord speaking? You have prophets in this country? Yes. You know, we may have thousands of known prophets in the country. Thousands of known prophets in the country. Yet, we may also have 100,000 unknown prophets. Prophets that they are not known by the majority of the people. Yet, they are prophets. And maybe I'm, I'm, I'm one of the unknown prophets who come with prophetic details about what the Lord is saying. Let me talk about John Mahama, Mahud Baumia, Alan Kwajutre Martin, Nana Kwami Bidiakon, Kennedy and Japan. Those of you who have been following our prophecies, remember concerning the MPP presidential, um, what's the name again? Uh, MPP, anyway, the elections that they did, they, 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 what, what's the name? Primaries and what? Presidential candidates, right? That was presidential candidates' election. All right, you know, we, we, we said it, and we gave details of what will happen. And again, we have to tell you at this time, so that you prepare, and you once again go before the Lord. When a prophecy is not coming in your favor, it doesn't call for insult, it calls for going before the Lord again. Remember, when King Hezekiah heard by prophetic message that he should put his house in place, he's going to die. This prophecy wasn't favoring him. He never insulted the prophet. He prayed to God. That is why we can give a prophecy. All what you have to do is to listen. You hear the prophecy and you know what the prophecy is about. You pray to God. Listen, when a prophecy is coming from me, it's coming from God. If you don't know, check, check the prophecies that it, I, I have been saying. When a prophecy is coming from me, it's coming from God. That is why if you don't know, you have to go and check the records of our prophecies. John Mahama. John Mahama. John Mahama. Remember in 2016, I came with details of what is going to happen. We don't predict elections. We give prophecies. Details of everything that will happen. And I remember in 2016, when the Lord brought... Ex-president Kofu, ex-president um, Jelly Rawlings at that time, and also uh, uh, President Mahama in my room, and the Lord said that they are going to be, they are going to be uh, ex-presidents of the nation. And I told you in 2016 that that says the Lord is going to be a change. Many people doubted it. Yet, after the elections, they realized that indeed, God was speaking. Why do you always have to doubt and see the results before you believe? That is why many people, they don't pray over their prophecies. Please. The Lord gave me an opportunity and I was with John Mahama. I've been with John Mahama this year, 2024, in so many occasions, in a spirit. I don't know him personally. I've never met him before. And I appreciate that. But now, in a spirit, I've been with him so many occasions. And one of them is this. In a vision, 
I saw myself uh, at a choba. A choba. And all of a sudden, I saw the president, John Mahama, the ex president, coming. He entered the choba, picked his bull, and then he was going to get some food. When I saw him, I rushed to him and I said, no, 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 no. I can't allow you to do this yourself. Please kindly sit down and I will get your food for you. You know, those of you who understand choba, you can't choba, you look how one nibi. You can't look how one nibi. You can't and the president Fana Yua, Fana Yua, and I'm a Gia Yua no Sema Mintomo. So I got him the food. And he started eating. I was also eating. No one was paying attention. People were there eating. Everyone was busy eating. As if they don't know that the president is here eating with us. It looks like that in a vision. Now, he sat down and he finished the food. And after. He had finished eating. He was going out from the place. Then I saw people recognizing him now and they were rushing to him. Please, can I take picture with you? Please, can I take your phone number? Many people were now coming to him. And the Lord said, son, have you noticed what is happening now? I said, yes, father. He said that the people, the people, Look at, look at, look at, look at what the people, they are doing. After he had finished eating, now they know that it is him. And the Lord said to me, the people want his comeback. Child of God. I agree with any prophet who will come with a prophecy and says that John Mahama will never become a president again. Yes, I saw it myself in 2016. Those of you who have been following our prophecies. I, I give details. We don't predict elections. We, we. I've never predicted an election before. I come with the details of it, how it's going to happen, what will cause it to happen. And that's why I'm telling you this. Maybe you might not know me, that's not a problem. I'm happy not to be known by the people of this country. But to be known by God, I'm so happy. Maybe you can call me the unknown prophet. A prophet, I don't know his name. Yes. There are a lot of people in the Bible, they were prophets. We never saw their names in the Bible. Yet they were giving accurate prophecies. I am one of them. Take it like that. Dr. Alhaji Baumia, our vice president. The Lord brought him to me. It was very important. And when he came, he came with Alan Chematen. And he came with Honorable Kennedy, a compro in Japan. The three of them came. I requested to pray for them. I requested to pray for them. All of a sudden, Horrible Canada, Japan, walks out of the church and he never allowed me to pray for him. I'm telling you what happened. I'm telling you what happened. He was so angry. He walked away. Then I saw Alan Koduche Martin kneeling down in time of the prayer. And I saw Alleji Maud Baumia sitting in a chair in time of prayer. A 
in time of prayer. Kennedy Japan walks out from the church. Very angry. I want all of us to pray for him. There is a lot of anger in the heart of our beloved father. Remember, I keep telling people that everyone in this country, we must respect them. They are leaders, they are fathers. The fact that you don't agree with them doesn't mean you insult them. He was so angry, very, very angry. And the Lord said, look at him. He's angry. Angry, angry. He is angry. And that wasn't a good sign. And I repeat, that wasn't a good sign. That wasn't a good sign. And the Lord said, pray for him. You know, he is a child of God. I'm telling you, I'm telling you what, what maybe you don't know. God loves him. But sometimes, at some point in our lives, we can get angry. It, 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 it even happens to Moses. Moses was so angry. So at this moment, in this time, Honorable Kennedy and Japan need prayers. Anger. Anger is moving all over him. I don't know him. I've never met him before. Of course, I wish one day I'll meet all of them, those that the Lord has been giving their information to me, only to say thank you to them. Maybe ask for their permission to pray for them. But we need to pray for him. With that high anger, it can destroy a lot of things. Allow Kodjo Chermatin kneeling down before the Lord. Praying. Praying. A sign of humility before God. Kneeling down. Al Haji Maud Maumia, our vice president, was comfortably sitting down. And he was also praying. My God. He was also praying. So I prayed for the two of them. And they left. When I was going, after the prayer session, I find myself in a certain town, which I believe it is in central region, called Akuti. A place they call Akuti. When I got to that place, after praying for the vice president, Elijah Maud Baumia, and Alan Tremartin, after praying for them, I was going somewhere. And when I got to Akuti, I saw Nana Kwame Bidiako. I think I'm right with the name. Nana Kwame Bediako. Asari Bediako Shedda. I saw him coming with documents. He has a lot of files. He was holding a lot of files. So I got there and I was like, please, one of the files on the floor. I pick it up for him. And he was busy looking through the documents, looking through the papers. And the Lord said to me, pay attention to this detail, son. So I was watching how he was going through the documents, so busy with the documents. And the Lord said to me, he's going to do everything possible in his capacity To be part of the presidential race. And he's not going to stop. Not this year. 
Maybe not the following years ahead of us. Too busy gathering documents. And I want you to know that. Too busy gathering documents. So let me present to you the four leaders by the mercies of God I have been praying for in the spirit. John Mahama at a chop bar going to get something to eat. When the people recognize him after he had finished eating. Honorable Kennedy at Japan walking away from the presence of God angry checking out from the presence of God angry Alan Martin kneeling down before God praying the vice president Alejim Mobia sitting in a chair praying Nana Kwami Bediako, busy gathering documents. This is what I have for you today. Remember, we are one people. We need to love each other. Remember, you might not know who I am. That you can call me the unknown prophet. It happens. There were a lot of unknown prophets in the Bible. Yet they were having details of prophecies. From God. God was speaking to them. <laughs> Something is about to happen in Ghana. I will come to you again. And then I will tell you who is taking December 7, 2024 election as a president in this country. When